Hey all and welcome to Sunday Fun Day with me, Boyana, and the rest of the BAA Bell Arts Attractions. You'll want to be guide to some of the cultural and arts events happening in Belgrade. We have managed to find some events that sound sweet to check out and support. Email us at bellartsattractions at gmail.com or belgradeartnews at gmail.com if you want us to mention your event on this show. We are trying really hard to grow, so if you want to help us out, click that subscribe button or leave a comment or a like or even share if you dare. A little goes a long way. All the links to the events will be in the description below, so check them out to bring traffic to the sites as well as to get more info. Right, let's get the paperwork out of the way and let us get into it with exhibitions. On Monday, the 30th of November, also known as the end of the month, there will be the continuation of an exhibition called Madame Butterfly, Jedan vek u Beogradu. Madame Butterfly, One Century in Belgrade. It is held at the Muzej Pozorišno Metnosti Serbije, Museum of Theatre Arts of Serbia, on Gospodar Jevremova 19. The entrance is free and you can view the works from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. on workdays and 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. on Saturdays. The exhibition will run until the 31st of December, also known as the end of the year. Since the venue is sticking to the current restrictions, only five people are allowed to view the works at a time. So grab your four friends, your mask, and head on down to get culturized on 100 years of Serbia. There is also another exciting exhibition that will begin this Wednesday, the 2nd of December at Moze Yugoslavia, Museum of Yugoslavia, on Mihaila Mike Jankovića 6. It will be the exhibition of Alan Ford, Trči počasni krug. Alan Ford runs the lap of honor. Alan Ford is a comic that our writer actually has a childhood connection with, as I'm sure quite a few of you may also do. When she was young, she would go into her parents' bedroom and look at the pictures, since the words were in a different language she couldn't read. This exhibition will show 152 original boards from the early period of 1969 to 1975, when the recognizable Italian author duo Magnus Bunker worked on the comic, as well as three title drawings by Paolo Pifareri. Luciano Secchi, Max Bunker, was the writer of the witty dialogue and satirical stories with the simple eye-catching style of cartoonist Roberto Raviola Magnus. I ho hope I pronounced all these names correctly. Check out the history of this beloved comic by heading down to Muse Yugoslavia, Museum of Yugoslavia. On Thursday, the 3rd of December, is the start of the International Queer Film Festival Merlinka. The festival will run till Sunday, the 6th of December. The festival wants to promote film titles that deal with gay, lesbian and transsexual topics which rarely reach the domestic film audience. And it aims to promote gay lesbian rights through film art and influence the reduction of homophobia. The festival is organized by the Gay Lesbian Info Center Glick and Dom Omladina Belgrade. It will be held at Dom Omladina on Makedonske 22 and tickets are 200 dinars. So see what they have going on in the link below. That brings us to the end of this episode of BAA Bell Art Attractions, your wannabe bi-weekly guide to the goings-on in the art world of Belgrade. If you want us to mention your show or event, please drop us a few lines in an email at bellartattractions at gmail.com or belgradeartnews at gmail.com. It would be wonderful if you can subscribe if you like what we do. I have been your host, Boyana, and remember to stay safe while you support the arts. Happy Sunday, have an awesome week ahead, and hopefully you'll get to see our gorgeous faces once again on YouTube soon. Bye!